Hey everybody, Justin Cena here. How's it going? I've got a great video for you all about print on demand. And I'm going to show you how to sell print on demand socks with Shopify. And you see an example on the screen right now. You've probably seen these maybe in Facebook ads or in YouTube ads promoting these really cool personalized socks, all done print on demand, all done Shopify. I'm going to show you step by step exactly how to do that. But first, real quick, I want to talk about what is print on demand, especially if you're new to the business model or if you've never heard of it before. Print on demand is by far the best business model that's on the internet today. I don't think anything even comes close. You get to sell hundreds of different print on demand products like t-shirts, all different styles of apparel, home decor, posters, canvas prints, even crazy print on demand dolls, all of which you'll never need to touch the product. You'll never pay for it up front. You'll never deal with ordering it up front or fulfillment or shipping or bubble mailers or the cheapest shipping labels or any of that stuff. This is how print on demand works. And it's really described right in the name, right? Print means produce. So the product, maybe it's a t-shirt, maybe in this case, it's socks. That product, those socks will get produced only when they're demanded. And in e-commerce, what does demand mean? Well, when ordered, right? And this should be the light bulb moment in your head right now saying, okay, I get to sell products that I never touch. I get to collect payment on them first and then everything else happens automatically with the print-on-demand integration that I'm gonna show you in a second. So it's a really, really hands-off business and it's also a cash flow positive one. And here's exactly how print-on-demand works. You're gonna have different designs, right? For example, at the beginning of this video, I showed you a uh, personalized print-on-demand socks where the uh, you know customer's face was on it, right? So you could have different designs, in this case it will be personalized based on the customer and you're gonna have those designs in your Shopify store. I'm gonna literally show you how to do that step-by-step step later on in this video. Once you have products in your store, then of course customers can come into your store and order and pay for those products, right? This is the best part about it right here. Our job is done, okay? We have products in our store, customers pay for those products, we collect the profit, our job is done. Now, this isn't because we're lazy, this isn't because of some you know great partnership we have going on, this is just how print-on-demand works. We sit back and relax and automatically what's gonna happen in the background is your print on demand partner is gonna receive the customer information, the order information, like you know, what design is it gonna be, what product, what size, what colors, what shipping address, all that information gets sent over to your print on demand partner automatically. And then the print on demand partner simply goes ahead and creates the product, ships it out to the customer. They even provide the tracking information to your customer via email on your behalf. It's an incredible business model where literally your job ends over here once we collect the profit. We don't need to do any of the hard work like creating the product or shipping the product, right? The whole idea of e-commerce is turned on its head here. We don't need to do anything except sit back, relax, and make sales. But specifically, why do you want to sell personalized socks? Well, you're always looking for unique, new, and intriguing products. And it doesn't matter if you are a print-on-demand rookie or a print-on-demand veteran, you always need to find unique products. And what we're doing on top of that is allowing the customer to personalize those products. And that takes things to a different level, right? That's the power of print-on-demand plus personalization. They're literally creating a product. So by definition, it's always gonna be a unique product. And on top of that, there's zero risk, right? With print-on-demand, you have no upfront product costs. So you always want to just be trying out new and exciting products. These personalized socks definitely fit that criteria. And again, personalized means it's always gonna be new, it's always gonna be unique, it's always gonna be intriguing because it's customizable by the customer. So how are we going to sell personalized socks? Well, we're gonna use the Tsunami Print On Demand app. The reason I use them is they offer personalization right inside of your Shopify store. I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. Just a quick four step setup. We're gonna go ahead and install the Tsunami Print On Demand app. You see over there, podapp.justincener.com. We're gonna to go to the product section of the app. We're gonna find the socks. We're gonna choose our style. And then we're simply gonna add it to our store and promote it, let's say via Facebook ads or through your email list or however you wanna market your store. And this is gonna be what we're looking at inside the store. We'll go over the shoulder in a second. These are gonna be the personalized print-on-demand socks inside of the Tsunami print-on-demand app. So all you need to do is install that app. It's free to install, podapp.justincener.com. And let's go over the shoulder and create those personalized socks. Now we are inside of the Tsunami app. We're in the product section and you see all of these different categories of print on demand products, hundreds of different print on demand products, all with that no risk, no inventory model. 
We're gonna scroll down here to the socks and ties section. And you see they also have some nice neckties. We're gonna be looking at the crew socks. You got $9.64 cost if you are a free user, $7.57 cost if you are a premium user. We'll click into here. And this is that really great one page product builder for Tsunami. Literally everything is right on the screen right here. We don't need to do anything else. First thing that we need to do is take a look at which type of print on demand. Standard print on demand will be where we create a design and they buy the design as is. For example, this is a design with the California and the bear, right? They could buy this as a print on demand design or whatever we desi uh, whatever design we create. Okay, we're talking about personalization. So we're moving over here into the uh, one of these two options. Pre-designed is basically you upload a design and then you allow them to customize that design by adding their own images to the design or adding in text on top of the design. That's one option. The option we're gonna go with is full personalization, literally giving them the full canvas of the sock to create their, uh, you know, their perfect product. They could upload a photo, they could upload an image, they could uh, add text, they could do any combination of that. So that's what we're gonna allow them to do. And that's step one. We set up which type of personalization or which type of print on demand. Next, we come over to the title. I always like to give them a little bit of instruction. I'd say personalize it, turn your photos into socks. Okay, over here, I like to come down over here. I'll add my three part product description or basically any product description that you want to use. Basically, you just want to tell a story to get them excited. Here we see our pricing and we can even go a little bit higher because we are selling personalized items. Always has that higher perceived value. Going to get close to 60% margin on here. And here's our shipping cost, $4 in the US. Production time, two to three days, shipping three to five days. They should get this in under a week, right? And we're allowing for full personalization. And, and that's it. That's all we need to do. It's incredibly easy over here. We click publish to store. And in just a matter of seconds, this product has been added into our Shopify store. We'll come over here into the product section. And we're going to go find those personalized socks. Here they are. Personalize it. Turn your photos into socks. We'll go ahead and open this up in our store. And you see we have our title. Of course, we have our image. We have our customized product description and the pre-filled product description over here. And then you'll notice that we don't have an add to cart button. Um, instead, we have the personalize button. And all of this was created automatically by Tsunami. There's nothing extra that you need to do to enable this personalize button. If it's a personalizable product, Tsunami automatically adds this button. And instead of adding to cart, the customer will click that and this will open up and they'll be able to personalize their pair of socks. And you see that now they see a little mock-up of the socks and they're going to be able to actually build these socks by either adding images or adding text and we're going to go with add image i've gone ahead and shamelessly uploaded a photo of me holding one of my click funnels awards and we're going to put these on a pair of socks over here and uh, you'll see that this photo will get added to our photo library right on the side of the page and uh, then we'll simply drag this image over and it's time to start resizing we're going to drastically make this image bigger and put it right inside of our socks here and you'll see once it gets bigger we can start playing around with the positioning make it lower a little bit All right that actually looks pretty good i'd wear these so then we have the uh you know kind of look of what the customer is going to get they then go ahead and press the cart button and it saves this image and uses this in the cart and this is a really cool feature pay attention to the actual thumbnail image inside of the cart listed for these socks, it quickly changes into the actual mock-up that we had created. And this is a really big deal. I've been doing personalization for a while. Really nice increase in conversion rate when we implemented this because we get to see the preview inside of the cart, or more importantly, the customer gets to see a preview of what they're about to buy. Even though it's personalized, they still see it right at the decision-making point of purchasing. So a really great feature here, and all this again is done by Tsunami, happens automatically um, that's just how this app works with personalization. It's super powerful. So um, really, I think this could work in a variety of niches. You give the customer full control, let them just have um, you know, full design control and personalize the entire product. And that's really going to allow you to always have that unique product in there. Not to mention, you just don't see too many people selling socks. So uh, I know this is going to help you make some money. I hope you add it into your store. I hope it works well for you. If you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, I'll talk to you real soon. Thanks a lot.